For Pete's sake. For Pete's sake. Uh, <laughs> you, like, you, like, you like what I did there? All right, 516 <laughs> right now. Let's see if the wind and uh, weather is going to cooperate for yeah. firefighters out there, John. <laughs> oh, that was a good one. <laughs> um, you know what? It is still going to be hot and still going to be dry, but at least we're not getting hotter. So there's a little plus out there. Temperatures are gradually, ever so gradually, cooling down the rest of the week. You're looking outside at some low gray hanging out there right through San Francisco. A little bit of sunlight in the distance. Anticipate a really nice sunrise here in just a little minute if you want to stay put with us for a few more. As for radar, you can see we do have a bit of cloud cover near the coastline, but very clear, very dry inland. New smoke from fires burning in the Sierra Nevada is not heading our direction. So really, that haze that you're detecting out there in eastern Contra Costa and Solano counties, for the most part, has to do with the marsh fire. And just that smolder subsurface there that is still putting up that smoke that I know a lot of you driving along Highway 4 have been picking up as you make your drive along that route. Hot inland, high pressure ridge still in place, foggy at the coast, and even though we're not as hot as we were yesterday, you still have that wide variety of temperatures going on here. Some 60s at the coast and still some 90s for our inland areas. You can see that in your four zone forecast. Cool in SF and at the coastline, while our Bay Shore City, some of our most comfortable, Burlingame at a nice 77, Mountain View, warm at 80 degrees and still hot for the South Bay in the 80s to low 90s. Similar range of numbers for the South Bay. Union City up to Oakland in the 70s, while Danville and Concord at 91, Antioch and Vacaville at 95 degrees each. Our hottest spots, believe it or not, that's actually a cool down from yesterday. And tomorrow, just a little cooler yet. You can see it's not a big change from day to day, but it is at least not getting hotter. By Friday, the weekend, our coolest day of the forecast. Highs at our warmest in the mid 80s. Raina? John, thank you for that. Well, we have